All right, ladies, listen up. Welcome to Sports Minute for Girls, where in one minute I'll explain something sports-related, hopefully providing you with a wealth of knowledge to impress the guys. This week, we're tackling the slippery history of Toronto's beloved hockey team, the Toronto Maple Leafs. It's a long-winded history, so fitting it into one minute may be a bit tough. You're going to have to bear with it. Ready, set, go. The Leafs were founded in 1917, only back then they weren't known as the Maple Leafs. They went by the ever descriptive name, the Blue Shirts. Since being founded, the Leafs have also been known as the Toronto Arenas and the Toronto St. Patrick's. But when Conn Smythe took control of the team in 1927, they officially became the Toronto Maple Leafs. Between 1942 and 1967, the Leafs were part of what is known as the Original Six, the first six teams in the NHL before it was expanded. The organization has won a total of 13 Stanley Cup championships, but if you haven't heard, the last one was in 1967, 43 years ago, the longest dry spell in the NHL. Since 1967, the Leafs haven't even played in the championship round and have only been to the playoffs 16 times. Needless to say, the last 43 years have been a sad blemish on the history of the club. But when the day comes and Toronto wins their next Stanley Cup, expect some great parties in the street. But don't hold your breath. Seriously, don't. Just in case. This has been Sports Minute for Girls. I'm Kathleen Peroff.